the level of crisis in Enugu state is going into another dimension. Enugu state that used to be one of the coolest city in Nigeria has turned into a war zone where people are living in fear. Simon Ekpa has condemned the ceiling of businesses and the killing of residents for protesting against closing their shops while demanding for a visa ban on Governor Peter Mba, the governor of Enugu State. Simon Ekpa, a self-acclaimed disciple of the detained leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, Maazi Namdekano, and a self-proclaimed prime minister of Biafra government in exile, has written to the European Union and the United States of America over the killings and alleged human rights violations carried out by Governor Peter Mba of Enugu State against residents. Simon Ekba condemned the ceiling of businesses and killing of residents for protesting against closing their shops while demanding for a visa ban on Governor Peter Mba. According to information from Sahara reporters, which reported that on Wednesday, 26th July 2023, security agencies Governor Peter Mba deployed to await a main market, killed two traders and injured several others when traders took to the street to protest the ceiling of their shops by the government for not opening for business on Monday. It should be recalled that IPOB, a pro Biafra group agitating for Biafra, in September 2021, called for every Monday sit at home protest in the Southeast region to force the Nigerian government to release their leader, Mazin Namdekano, who has been in custody of the DSS since June 2021, despite various court judgments discharging him of any crime. The federal government is not making any plan of releasing the IPB leader. Residents of the Southeast, including Enugu State, have been observing the sit at home on Mondays until July 5, 2023, when Governor Peter Mba declared a ban on sit at home, insisting that the protest was ruining the economy of the state. He consequently warned that any business, market, or school that did not open on Mondays would be shut down indefinitely. Through to his threats, on Monday, Governor Peter Mba began to seal businesses and banks he accused of observing an illegal sit at home. In the end, he sealed over 106 shops and malls and vowed that the six shops would remain closed for one week before his government could consider whether to unseal or auction the shops if certain conditions are met. Following the development, Simon Ekba condemned the brutal attack on the people of Biafra who are exercising their fundamental human rights to protest in a letter written to the international community. In the letter titled, Human Rights Abuse Against the People of Enugu State by Peter Mba, the Governor of Enugu State, Biafra, Southeast Nigeria. Simon Ekba accused Governor Peter Mba of confiscating and locking up people's businesses and means of sustenance without recourse to the constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria or any charter, treaty or convention known anywhere in the civilized world. The letter reads, We wish to bring to your notice the gross violation and fundamental human rights abuses of the people of Enugu State, Biafra, in Southeast Nigeria by Peter Mba, the governor of Enugu State. Peter Mba is confiscating and locking up people's businesses and means of sustenance without recourse to the constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria or any charter, treaty or convention known anywhere in the civilized world, thereby denying the people of Enugu State the right to personal property and free enterprise. On Wednesday, 26th of July, 2023, 
he ordered the massacre of protesters in Enugu state where two innocent Biafrans were massacred and many injured. Peter Mba is currently in court for academic certificate forgery during the last election in Nigeria. The elders and religious leaders in Enugu state have been calling for Peter Mba to resign from office. Hence, in a bid to save his political life, he has resorted to playing a stooge to the ruling Islamic party that is the All Progressive Congress APC of Nigeria, who in turn is using Peter Mba to hunt down their perceived political opponent Christian in Enugu state that is Biafra land. By this letter, we are notifying you of the atrocities of Peter Mba and the ruling Islamic APC party in Nigeria. We request that you impose a visa ban on Governor Peter Mba and add him to the list of terrorists and haters of freedom and democracy in Nigeria. Simon Ekpa concluded.